Is it hard to access affordable, healthy food? Then listen carefully. Daryl Addison, an African-American inventor, has patented a process for growing food on demand. He called it Torpedo Pot. Torpedo Pot is a fully automated flower pot that gives you control over your plant's environment. All you do is add soil, seeds, and plants to the flower pot and watch it grow. Yes, Torpedo Pot grows the rest. Visit www.torpedopot.com. Welcome back to the African Diaspora News Insider. I'm Ungil Zalalem bringing you this report. Today's report comes from Nigeria. A female lawmaker was beaten and stripped naked by her own colleagues. It was because of a disagreement. Both sides are saying something different. They're saying that she shouldn't have left with something that did not belong to her. She's saying that she didn't do it. Regardless of what she has done, to beat a woman, a lawmaker, a government official, and strip her naked and vandalize her car, there's no justification for that in my opinion. They can go to court, they can call the police on her, and she gets arrested until investigation. Anything can be done other than what they did to her. It's just so ridiculous. Now they're denying that they did that. Obviously, there are there's pictures of uh, her naked that shows with her ripped clothes and with her car vandalized. So the truth is somewhere in between. And however you look at it, this is not right. This is not something that should happen. It's the 21st century, for God's sake. Like this lady is an official. This lady deserves some kind of respect. If you're willing to do that to a lawmaker, imagine what kind of confidence they have to do it to an average Nigerian, an average person just living their life. That won't get any justice because no one knows about them. No one cares. But if they're okay doing this to a woman that has influence, that can get people to come and support her and stand up for her this is sending the wrong message i believe to the younger generation to the average person it's telling them that if you do something wrong the answer is violence not justice not the law but violence and violence against women the audacity i can't even believe that we're talking about this and this is a lawmaker that we're talking about this is really crazy. So I hope Miss Cynthia Nuela takes them to court and gets her justice because she has pictures, she has people that witnessed it, and now it's time for her to go ahead and teach them that this was not okay. Anyways, guys, let us know down below what your thoughts are about this. I am Ungil Zalal. I'm bringing you this report. I will see you on the next one. Bye. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and download the African Diaspora News Channel app now available on Google Play and the Apple App Store. Colonization never ended in the white supremacist system. And as we see today, the colonization is in the mind. Now those who have been enslaved and those who have been colonized, we're still dealing with the remnants of that through the colonization of the mind. Pick up my book, Seven Steps to Decolonize the Mind, and we will help deprogram you from the colonization that was put upon you by generations and generations of white supremacy. You can pick it up today on amazon.com.